Why, hello, boys and girls. Last week in my first vlog in months, got over 100 views. Appreciate the uh, the love, guys. I got some feedback. I know a couple things. One, like I said before, um, I'm still learning my new camera, so I had some autofocus issues, but I think I fixed it, hopefully. So we'll see what happens with this video. Um, basically, it has like this kit lens and now it has a built-in autofocus and the camera is already set to autofocus so it's kind of like having like two things trying to autofocus and it's kind of like it's like fighting each other so I disabled it in the camera and let the lens do the work so we'll see if that does the trick and also people uh, some people complained about the, uh, the lighting and I know that's been an issue it's been something I never fixed for years when I try to do vlogs and stuff but I bought a little nice thing here um, looks pretty good. Um, does it look good, guys? Let me know. So, but uh, and also another thing too, shave my head. Yeah, I was meaning to do it for a while. Um, no particular reason. I just want to do it. Um, I've been going through like multiple styluses, and you know, these can't get my like hair right for some reason. I don't know if I'm picky because I thought I had like a fairly common like you know hairstyle. Um, Cause basically what I wanted to do is like you know one to zero fade sides and back and a little trim on the top because I always like always like to fo uh, comb at the side and then I have a hard part right here and my last two stylists uh, prior to the one that shaved my head uh, they didn't know what like, the hard part is um, the one before that I cut my hair like in uh, October uh, it was it was a struggle and she gave out like hints like she don't know what she's doing. But like I felt bad, like I just didn't want to like you know get up the, from the chair and leave. But I should have done that because when I tore like what I wanted, one to zero on the fade and the sides and back and trim top and the hard part, she looked at me weird. She's like fade. That's when I should just get up the chair and just walk away. But I just don't want to be rude. But yeah, I kind of regret it. I should just like walk away because. Uh, I had to explain, I was just like, you know, fade. Um, and I'm trying to think of another word. I'm like, um, transition? I said, oh, transition. And I'm just like, really? Like, you, you didn't understand fade, but you understand transition. So I go like one to zero. She's like, okay, two. And I'm like, no, one to zero. And she's like, okay, okay. And, and then so she did it, right? And uh, she had like a unique way of cutting. You know, like, everyone has their own way. So I shut my mouth and let, let the, the professional do the work. And uh, afterwards, like, you know, before she cut the top, she's like, yo, what do you think so far? And I look like Mr. Burns, kind of, you know, because I'm just like, you know, I think you missed the middle part here. And she's just like, what are you talking about? That's exactly what you wanted. And I'm like, no, that's not what I wanted. It's not a fade. You can't tell me that's a fade. Because it was, it was like, it was a lot more here compared to here and here. And she's like, no, that's exactly what you said. One is zero. One, two, and then zero. And I'm like, I pause for a minute. I'm just like, you know, dude, really? Uh, I, I was just like, kind of like, okay. When I meant two, I meant T-O-2, not T-W-O-2. One to, one to zero. And she's like, oh, so you want one and zero. I said, like, you should have said that. And I'm just like, what? I'm just like, um. I'm like, okay. One and zero. Okay, so she did it, and uh, it was a bit of a hack job because she did literally like one and zero. There's no like transition fade or. <laughs> now I'm gonna start saying transition because of her, but you know it's not a fade. It's like one and then zero, and uh, I'm just like, is there any way you can blend? And she's like, you know, you never asked for that, and I'm just like, you know, I said fade. I, I thought that's a more common term for hairstylist, you know, and. She's like, okay, so you want a blend, one and zero. And I'm like, yes. So she did, and it was okay. I was like, whatever. She trimmed the top just a little bit, you know? I was just like, you know, I, I come here every month, so it's like, it grows out, like, you know, maybe like half an inch every month. So it was just like half an inch, so she did. And it was a bit of a close call because she almost did an inch. But then I was just like, no, half inch, half inch, and you know, she, 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 she like had her, her clippers, or I'm sorry, her scissors, 
And then she, she almost about to cut like an inch. And she's like, yeah, this much? I'm like, no, no, no. And it's like half inch. I'm like, oh, half of an inch. And I'm like, that's what I said. <sighs> so she did. And, um, and I asked for a hard part. And then she's like, hard part? And I was just like, you know, like, you know, you can, is this your first month? And she said, no, I've been cutting hair for like 10 years. I'm like, really? And then I was just like, you know what? So I showed pictures. And then I was just like, you know, hard part, you know? And she's just like, well, your hair doesn't break from here to here. And I was just like, exactly. That's why you have to make the line. And I'm just like being very patient for her. And I'm just like, oh my gosh. Uh, you know, and then I kept showing the picture and I'm just like trying to like have an example. There's plenty of examples. I mean, you know, the hairstyle I have is, is fairly common because I, I type the fade and I like, you know, a bunch of pictures of, of what I wanted, like first thing that came up. So I showed it to her and then she was just like, you know, okay, okay. So, so she tried to make lines. She's just like, you know, I guess she's trying to figure out how to do it. Apparently it's her first time doing it. So she did it. It, the problem is like she didn't hold this hair here so like the hair is getting like you know getting cut as well so as she's doing the line like you know this 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 part here is getting cut too and and then afterwards like I, I told her stop I was like you're cutting this part here and, it, and, it, and then she's like well I, it, what can I do is this like you know it's 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 in the way I was like you hold it down and then she's like oh okay and I'm just like really like I was like I'm just like I can't believe I'm going through this and then she finally uh, you know did it didn't do it because she didn't want to do it too deep she's she's afraid I'm just like all right if you're not feeling comfortable that's okay but but she cut some of this too so I was just like damn now the hair spiking up and I'm supposed to come inside but now it's like sticking out here because it's short. And then, and then she tried to give me suggestions. It's just like, you know, we try to poof up the hair so that way it'll blend with it. And I'm like, well, it's not really what I wanted, but okay, whatever, you know. So I'm, I'm just like so disappointed. So like last weekend, I'm like, all right, it's time for a cut. I thought about it and I'm like, you know what? I need to reset because this, this whole part here is messed up. And then this, this not so fade fade is, is not really good. So. I said, screw it, just give me one on top of zero size. And the person was just like, are you sure? And I'm like, yeah, I, I need to reset. So, and, and here we are today. And I, I don't mind it. It's been a long time since I had cut it this short. So, you know, it's, I used, I used to rock that good old classic surfer cut for many years, so. But now it's short. And I don't know, I might keep it short. A lot of people like it, so. You know, and it's also good, like, because I like to wear wigs on cosplay. So, guys, I'm not gonna lie, I was very close to not making a vlog this week. Um, even though last week I was, I strongly said with emotion that I'm trying my best to do this every week. And, and I had all the excuses in the world. Like, number one, holiday materials this weekend, and not really at a con crunch. Um, I'm making the, uh, the shirt of Winter Bakugo. Um, everything's all set, so I have to make the shirt. So here's the progress. I have to make the, 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 the neck part and the designs, but I sew this. And it's really nice. It, it fits really well, and I can't wait to put the rest of the stuff. But it, the rest of the stuff is going to be very easy. And also, I'm a little bit under the weather. Um, taking a bunch of emergency this week, so that way I can be healthy uh, for holiday matsuri. It's so isn't it such a weird thing like you know when you're planning to go to a trip you somehow get sick of that week I, I, I don't know I don't know if it's just me or what because I kind of got sick of the week of AWA but like you know I just pound myself with like freaking emergency and that that killed me up and I'm gonna do the same thing this week but it seems like a coincidence you plan a trip you're gonna get sick that week never fails but anyways, yeah, so I had those two excuses. I'm pretty sure you guys would understand, but me personally, I'm like, you know what, you're gonna do this. Because if you're not gonna do this, you're gonna get a habit of making a bunch of excuses. I watched one of Joe Rogan's podcasts, and there's one that's like a bit of a cliche. He says something along the lines like, you know, if you wanna work out or if you wanna do something that you really want to do, just do it. 
It sounds easier said than done, but when he made his examples afterwards, it makes a lot of sense. You know, we set our alarm clocks to wake up to go to work. You know, we have to go to work because if you don't go to work, you ain't gonna get paid. You don't get paid, you're not gonna pay your bills. So you're trained to go to work to pay your bills. Also, when you wake up, you brush your teeth. Well, I hope some of y'all watching this brush your teeth when you wake up, but you're trained to do it. You brush your teeth every morning. So you could do the same thing if you're working out or if you want to do something. You just have to change your mentality. That's like the number one thing. You change your mentality and you make it a habit and sure enough, you're gonna be working out like almost every day or three times a week or whatever. So I'm trying to get my mindset ready to be like, you're gonna do a vlog every week. You have to put something out. Even if it's a two minute video or whatever, I'm gonna make vlogs every week. So that's like my mindset. So. I am sick, I need to get ready for Holiday Matsuri, but I'm going to do this vlog. I'm leaving my house on Friday morning, drive up to Orlando, I will be at Holiday Matsuri around noon, I'm going to be there until Sunday afternoon. I'm planning to do Todoroki for Friday, a winter version of Bakugo on Saturday, and I was going to do um, Blue Jeans Bakugo on uh, Sunday. So if you guys see me, don't be afraid to come up to me and say hi. Um, I'm going to bring this camera with me and take a bunch of pictures. I'm going to film myself for the future vlog. Um, and I'm going to do that, that thing. Um, what's that S word again? Um, s -s 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 socialize, that's it. So I'm going to, I'm going to attempt to socialize a lot uh, for this weekend. So, But it's going to be so much fun. You know, I, I really can't wait for holiday that series. Well, that's it for my vlog. Um, if you can't hook a brother up, like this video, subscribe to my channel, follow my social media, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.